What are you doing, Istvan? You started reading before finishing our assignment. I told you it needs to be done by tonight. What are you doing? Yeah, I know about the deadline, but you know my roommate was back in Hungary last weekend, and he bought one bottle of wine from Tokai region. Really? The quality is so excellent, I could not resist. Hmm, it seems nice. I really want to try this as well. You are lucky, boy. I have one glass with me. Oh, thank you, my friend. Thank you. Bro, that's liquid gold. It's terrific. It's amazing. I'm heading towards Istanbul Lager to buy a bottle for me as well. I'm really sorry. Unfortunately, you cannot buy here this very thing in Sweden. Really? Such a pity. We need to fix that bro, definitely. Hello and welcome to our presentation. We are Fotis and Istvan and we will introduce you to our idea called Why Not? As a newly formed startup, we have the ambition to create a digital platform that will help small wine producers who face difficulties to commercialize our products and enter into new markets. So our business proposition is to connect those people through our platform directly with restaurants and bars. We started building our winemakers base in Tokai, which is a historical wine region and a declared World Heritage Site in Hungary. We identified that producers in this region are struggling to sell their premium wine abroad despite its exceptional quality. But one can wonder how that happens, how it's possible that producers with rare and unique varieties face such type of difficulties? Well, Istvan has the answer. I participated in a small festival in the Tokai region where I could talk with many winemakers. They told me that their children are living behind the old winemaking tradition because of the low profit margin. Another pain point is that traditional French, Italian wine producers make it difficult for small winemakers to enter new markets. Finally, we found that the available wine selling platforms mainly operate as a web shop. They don't offer a customized value to the restaurants and they are not specifically tailored for their dishes. So, by creating a community where restaurants and bar owners will interact directly with winemakers, we can help both sides to create value. The winemakers will just have to create their own profile in the platform, upload photos of their products, describe their characteristics and the unique story behind each of them. A fee will be charged for the service and by that, wine producers will directly sell the products without disposing the surplus value to intermediates and wholesalers. On the other side of the spectrum, the restaurants will only have to register to the platform and select the products that are appropriate for the form and the type of their cuisine based on their unique description. And above all, these benefits will come in a much lower cost for them as no mediators will get involved in the whole process. We are Fotis and Istvan, two wine enthusiasts, and we have already made direct contacts with winemakers from the Tokai region. Both of us have engineering background, so we could contribute to the business development from a technical point of view. My grandfather made wine before, so I have some insight into this business. We want to make Tokai wine available to all wine lovers in Sweden. As one of the winemakers from the Tokai region pointed out, if we cannot make success out of the premium quality, then from what else could we? So let's make a sustainable business together and help winemakers introduce their premium wines to the Swedish market. Find us at contact why not store. Cheers!